Welcome back, everybody. King Rara right here, and I'm going to be your host for this evening. Welcome to episode three of my uh, King Pack series. So, right now it is night outside, meaning we can't really do a lot. So, for now, while we are waiting for night to dissipate, what I'm going to say is let's stop for a moment to appreciate a very nice looking dress. That is a very nice looking dress, I've got to admit. But I don't know about the guy who's actually wearing it, so um, sorry about making your eyes bleed on that part <laughs> all right so today we are going to have to get started on botania the last two episodes all we've been doing was messing around building this nice little hovel of ours let's get the lex uh lexica botania and basically i'll give you a real quick tour around um i might move those but that's the tinker stuff go upstairs off to the right we've got a nice little balcony area down here is our bedroom now we go over here go back up go over to the left and we get to the main balcony which has the dining room or uh, uh, eating room whatever you want to call it the kitchen we've got nice little uh, chest areas for um, food Let's grab some food. We are going to be hungry. And down over to the left is another balcony area down here. We could peek out a little tiny window. And we have a nice storage area. So we will have a lot that we can do with this nice little dirt hovel of ours. But to get started with the Lexica Botania, we must get started with the petal apocrathy in order for botanists to create plant life form or plant life they can do it's that can do its bidding if i can learn to english <laughs> one would need special means of infusing plants with mystical energies luckily the petal apothecary does that just for you oh nice you can um but I don't want to oh shift click to remove okay there we go um next page there we go that's what it's supposed to look like how to make it this block place in the world and given some water by use of water bucket oh we're gonna need iron we'll accept any mystical petals thrown in it releasing their energies uh, once one has set the correct uh, set, once one has set the correct petals in, throwing some seeds will finalize the process. Tossing in a fuel bucket will also fill the recipient with water. Quite a few plants can be made using this method. For more information, read on the functional flora in the generation flora sections of this lexicon. Shift right click the petal apothecary with an empty hand and it will remove the last item thrown in. Lastly, tossing in vines also gives the block an overgrown visual. So we will need cobble cobblestone slabs, any kind of mystical petal, and th four cobblestone. But before we can get started on cobblestone, we are going, I mean, the apothecary, apothecary, um, I'm going to have to go mining for some iron. So, I will go get the materials and we'll be back in a jiffy. Okay, so we have gotten the five iron, nine cobblestone. But unfortunately, we don't have any more coal because I was silly one time. Oh, got some stone. Oh yeah, I forgot I was going to make that. That's going to be useful later. So, what I want to do is make one 
charcoal. Oh no, I forgot. You can't make charcoal with planks. You have to have logs. Oh well. Um, let's just throw five more in there. And that should be enough to cook the iron. Just needed three iron. Okay, well, while we're at it, let's make the cobblestone slabs and go get a flower down in this chest over here. Now, which flower do we have the most of? It looks like we got mostly purple. <coughs> So for those who do not know, to get a flower petal, let's just get one, I don't want to mess up by accident, you just put it in your 2x2 two two crafting grid and it gives you two mystical petals. Now, the reason why I wanted stone was because I want to make some slabs and, okay, where'd it go? I had it on me. I keep on losing things. Okay, we got the bucket. Um, the lexica, lexica. Tell me, what am I needing? All right. Okay, so that will be a very easy thing. So the rest, we just go like this, and voila, we've got the petal apothecary. Apothecary. Quite a mouthful, if I do say so myself. We might be putting the petal apothecary outside uh, sometime whenever it's not dark out. But for now, let's put that right here. We're going to need a water source. Hmm. Well, it doesn't hurt to have an infinite water source inside your house, right? So let's put that there. And this here all right get the water bucket we're gonna have to run in and out very quickly mobs everywhere most likely ah, get in there we go that's one bucket we're gonna need one more oh we hear that yep skeleton die 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 okay that was a special mobs skeleton. So that's going to be in this pack if you ever decide to play the king pack. All right. There we go. We got an infinite water source right underneath our nice little uh, staircase. So we throw the water in there. Oh, that looks very nice. And now we've got ourselves an apothecary very nice very nice what i wanted to make earlier uh, i forgot that i threw in here i wasn't paying attention was this um i think i'm doing it right no i'm not doing it right uh let's see here it's in the ars magica mod unless i have to research it unfortunately but i doubt it um where 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 are you I think it's caught a candle. Warding candle. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I was thinking it was a stone slab for some reason. So it's not a stone slab. It is something I do not have. So we'll have to wait some other time for us to get that now, won't we? Back to the apothecary. We are going to now determine... Oh, has shared entry. See pedal effort. Oh, oops. Let's see here. How do I get back? Share next page. Bookmark. Oh, there's the back button right there. Okay, basics and uh, mystical flowers. There's 16 different kinds. Um, let's see here. You pluck off flowers, crafting the pestle and mortar. What does that do? Grinding into powder, which is used for what? Uh, right click the floor powder on any wool or carpet. It changes the color. Okay, that's basically what that is. 
Uh, so we're not going to make a pistol and mortar just yet. Um, let's see here. <coughs> you then floral fertilizer. So you want four floral white powder with one bone meal. Or two dandelion yellow, two rose red, plus one bone meal. That's quite... Stop sharing. I don't want to share. So the very first thing that we're going to want to make is the pure daisy. The pure daisy, what it does is it creates um, mana out of sunlight. So let's get that. Not only the most basic, but also the most important flower a botanist can have. This flower will purify any adjacent... Oh, sorry. No, I, I was thinking the wrong thing. This one is how we're going to make living wood and living stone, which we need in order to continue. Um, adjacent wood and stone blocks, as seen in the next page, into their purified uh, counterparts, living wood and living rock, which can be used for crafting. Just give it a minute or so... And living wood can be turned into twigs, living twigs to be more exact. Uh, white, white is bright and pure. Basically, we're going to need four white petals. Do we have white? We have white. So let's get this. And I believe we just throw it in. Yes. Do your magic. Do your magic. Uh, it did say four. Probably it just takes a bit of time. Cold purple petal. Oh yeah, seeds. I completely forgot. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, so to finalize it, we just throw in some seeds, and there we go. We got a pure daisy. Um, basically, you can't place it anywhere but dirt. So, we have plenty of dirt. Let's get some dirt. And my poor grandfather is sneezing up a storm out there. Um, let's see here. Is it dark out? If it's dark out, then we can't go out once again. But, we will go out. Uh, yep. So, we want that living wood. So let's go out. Let's just go out and risk it all. Risk for the win! Uh, okay. There's the zombie. Oh, no. Worst timing ever. No. No. Okay. We're running back inside. Um, yeah. Oh, no. Not good. Not good at all. Yeah, so... We have a witch right at our doorsteps. Ah, and I don't know if we can kill her. Okay, everybody. We managed to get the pure daisy. And we put some cobblestone and oak wood around it. So, all we need to do is give it some time. We got the uh, wood from up there. A few oak trees I'm very picky with what kind of wood I get normally so that's all I got so it's gonna take it a while in the meanwhile I also managed to get 10 more monster jerky let's get rid of this we don't need this no more ain't nobody got time for that um I'm thinking shears yes there we go while we are waiting, let's go in here. And bam. Let's double check the botanium for this. Um, white is pure and bright. Okay. Now, letting the wood surround it. Just give it a minute or so. So, that's all we can do. Let's give it time. Purify, scene, and next. Use for crafting. Aha! The wood has finished. We have now living wood. So this is a very good thing. We will start being able to. Okay. I'm thinking that. Yeah, it needs to be stone, stone. 
but we've got stone stone so we can get with the stone 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 making the living stone stone <laughs> okay one two three four five let that do that and let's make ourselves the living wood twig I remember correctly yes made the living wood twig now if you're wondering what does the living wood twig do for us we are going to need to start making the wand of the fortress made effectively by strapping a pair of mystical uh, petals to any color of any color to a few living wood twigs this is required for an amount of tasks the wand has two modes bind mode and function mode in bind mode it can be shift right click on a compatible block to select it shift right click clicking elsewhere binds the two blocks in function mode it simply not do that for shift right clicking the two modes can be switched freely by shift right clicking in the air. If the wand isn't bound to anything, shift right click a block allows it to be rotated around the axis of the side of its clicked on. For example, clicking on the top of a chest rotates it around. Most blocks which can be rotated should work. So we're going to need three of these to be honest, which means we are going to need more. Uh, of these living woods oh wow and that was quick on how quick this living rock oh wow this is really nice rock this rock I like it okay so let's just surround this baby surround this baby so we can make the living um, wand I mean the nature's wand will return one is oh, is will return when it is done so it has transferred all this wood that we wanted into living wood now let's go around gather all this living wood and voila let's go make them into twigs i got the petals that we're going to let me in let me in i got the petals that we're going to need for this so we're just going to need two there we go one two and then there's the third one one up there and one down here oh that's really nice now we have the wand of the forest now i forgot to mention that i also got a witch's hat from that witch i killed earlier all the left of the nasty witch i wonder if i could use it somehow it's from the well aquarium mod to be exact so if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a big fat like. Let's try to get up to maybe 5 likes, 10 likes. I'm still looking for those likes, guys. Come on, get, show me some love. I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye now, and enjoy.